down there with elbows. You're wet down, elbows. I got it. I got the wrist control. Oh, you got the wrist control? Oh, okay, okay. I got Ricky the shooter. What's up, baby? This is Buster Senior. Yeah. I used to go down there. Yeah. I used to box down there. Where? At Galena Park. Galena Park? Oh, okay, I know where you are. Oh, that's where I live. Yeah, he's like right here. Like Neighborhood? Right here. I don't know anything. It's the south, south, southeast. Hey, all you need to know is that's where I'm at. Neighborhood. Neighborhood. Hey. Neighborhood. <laughs> Represent. <laughs> Every time he says it like that, I just hear Vince Staples. North, north. <laughs> yeah, you ain't ready for that. No, no. See, that, that's the thing. It looked regular to you because you're amateur. But when you go pro, you'll, you'll realize. You're like, oh, shit. What's up? See, that's the difference between amateurs and pros right there. You know what I mean? Pros know they got to eat breakfast. <laughs> Most important meal of the day. <laughs> <laughs> See, you know I me, mean? another amateur, bro. He's, he's on one. He's on one today. A lot of pros ain't breakfast. I mean, take his meds. He ain't stop yet. I got. We've been going this whole time. I just go. Save that energy for the cage. Hell no, nah, I'm gonna be tight. I need to get excuse for why I'm getting my ass beat today. Camila is fucking hilarious. You know, food. Food starting to get smaller. Not me. Yeah, food starting to get smaller. Training intensity is at an all-time high, and then sleep. 24 at this moment, 24 days. I'm ready to kick the shit out of fun. What's going through right now? Right now? Day by day, day by day. Every morning I wake up, I got the music playing, I'm just like, I'm gonna beat the shit out of fun. <laughs> Get excited to go train. On my way to go train, but then I'm here. I look at who I had to go with to fucking get to fun. Like, Motherfucker, fuck all you guys. <laughs> I'm going home, but then I stay here. <laughs> Listen, bro. You know what I'm saying? Trying to get him some wisdom. Yeah, and shit. Nigga, nigga, I know everything. <laughs> <laughs> look, bro, I've been there, bro. I, I've been there, man. Saying, trying, trying to help a little couple of kids out. <laughs> <You know? laughs> After, um, what was it? Ali, the, the rumble in the jungle. God damn you old shit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and my doctor was, his, the, the dude who delivered me was this African doctor. Uh -huh. And he loved boxing. And so when I came out, he told my mom that I was going to be a fighter. This is what my mom told me, like, when I was 17. It's like, yeah, he told me, told me, the doctor said you are going to be a fighter. Now you want to do this shit. I was like, yeah. That's, That's a true insane. story. I forget, I, my mom knows the whole story, so I gotta get her to tell it when she comes down. Right, because you were a baby when it happened. <laughs> I was in a motherfucker. I remember one time my dad bought, bought me these boxing gloves. They took a plastic bag, put a bunch of clothes in it, tied it off on the roof. They just let me like hit the bag. I was so happy. I was like four. Wow. What were you doing at four? When I was four, I don't know. I think I wanted to be a football player up until I was like 10 or some shit. Maybe 12. And you realize this shit sucks. Yeah, I was like, I don't like football. <laughs> and then, uh, then I ain't want to do shit. And I still don't want to do shit. I don't even know who I am. Cam's still trying to find himself. So. He's deep. <laughs> Just trying to record motherfuckers' train. Oh, hell no. <laughs> Niggas ain't got no squabble. That's when you start beating me my shit. Ow! Yeah. <laughs> Come on, guys. I see you learning. Take notes, man. Where your pen and paper at? <laughs> Amateur, man. Being this shit. 